I'm of the first generation of children that were born from that Windrush generation. So my mother came here in 1958 and I was born in 1960. So we're of, I'm of that first generation of children that were actually born in the UK. I, I grew up not very far from here. In fact, just across the main road and behind there where this, the old, um, the new um, Holy Rosary School is, is where I lived. Chapel Town, historically, like many of the other black areas where black people were settled in the UK, were actually quite in transit areas. So um, it was where a lot of the worst housing was. Um, so yeah, things like that I remember. I mean, when we were growing up, we lived in that time when there was no Irish, no blacks, no dogs. You were hearing names, you were being called names, you didn't understand why. I suppose we got to a point back then where we were being told, why don't you go back where you come from? But we were born here, so it was a bit of a confusing time, very confusing. I think in Leeds, I see black people as the spice of Leeds, so we've added spice to Leeds. They had just had fish and chips before, now they've got curries and Caribbean restaurants and all of that. After the riots of, the racial riots of 1975, um, and again in 81, um, one of the things that became evident that we needed our own place. So the West Indian Centre, I think it was established in 1983. My role here, I came back to, to the West Indian Centre because I've done various things around the community. To be the director of the Leeds Bicentenary Project, I then left and came back again. So now I'm part of the kind of the, the fabric now. I do think it's important that we establish projects, we establish buildings, we establish a sense of we were here. I think it's, it's absolutely important to preserve history, um, to tell the stories of the journeys of the people that came. I mean, my mother, when she came over, she, I think she spent something like three and a half weeks on a boat down in the bottom of a boat to get here. I think it's important that um, we do pay respect to those that laid the foundation.